Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Don. I might be explosive when it's cracking to another one. TNT. Yo. I want to ask your opinion about something. Okay. I, 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 you sound happy. Uh, <laughs> the uh, there. I want to see if you think this man has a case. So there was a guy. We'll call him Jimbo Bob. And he was talking with a sex worker on his iPhone. He's married. So, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't want this to happen, to be found out by his wife, right? You know, he's trying to schmooze a little bit with a, with a cam girl or something on, on the internet. He then deletes the text messages off of his iPhone, but he forgot that he had sync on. So his wife saw the messages on their iMac at home and is now suing, is leaving him and, you know, trying to whatever. <laughs> Um, suing, leaving. I him mean, I said suing him, but I meant whatever. I meant leaving him. Okay. Uh, yeah, I missed. I was wondering because that's like there's there's a lot of there's a lot of no no no. Gray area so there. now this man is going to try to sue Apple for oh. not giving a proper warning that when you delete the messages in one place, it does not delete them in all places. He definitely got a case. Really? Yeah. You think he's got a case? Yeah. Okay. Ruined his marriage. He ruined his marriage. Uh, because he believed in their product. <laughs> so, wait, wait, wait. So, not the fact not the fact he was doing it. The fact he got caught is what ruined his marriage. Now you're talking. <laughs> wait a second. That's what happened. Honestly, so now that Apple, is it. So, now Apple's going to have to pay him millions of dollars. Look, a ruined marriage is a production line, Okay. And obviously, Wait, explain that a little bit. It's, it's it's last in, first out. All right, L I F O. How are you comparing like stock sales to a marriage? It's, that's very funny that you would say stock sales when I was thinking Magic the Gathering. All right, so last in, first out. So that means is that the last thing in the production line that ended the marriage will be the first thing that matters that ended the marriage. So what ended the marriage? Him getting caught. As yeah. far as I'm concerned. So. Well, I mean, that was the final straw, obviously. Yeah. Well, yeah. Because we wouldn't even be having this argument if you didn't find out. It. Am I? What, do I sound like I'm like I'm like I'm caping for the, I don't the know cheaters? What I don't. I can't tell what it sounds like you're doing right am, now. Am I, do I sound like I'm a cheater in, in, enthusiast? A cheater enthusiast. <laughs> like I'm a cheater. You like you like you got a note in your pocket right goddamn now with the answers to the test on it. Like I'm an infidelity uh, Affici- God, a, aficionado. Not aficionado. No, no. Like I'm an. In- Hold on. Let me get it. Hold on. Breathe. Think. <laughs> All right, he's coming. Like I'm it's gonna an be good. Infidelity. Uh, aficionado. It's not aficionado. <laughs> del- sympathizer. Oh. Like I'm an infidelity sympathizer. No. A Jonas. delicious infidelicious. <laughs> that I'm not that either. <laughs> I'm not an infidelity sympathizer. But I am saying is that it is a production line, so the last thing that happened is the last thing that counts. So, you shouldn't. Have but why is that. it Apple's fault? Uh, because I thought my security was safe. Thank you, Apple. If my wife can find it, what's to say? Why does that dumbass some, sink all his stuff? What's to say that some company can't find it and use my information? Huh? What? That's what I'm saying. You're, are you just talking? Are you just saying words? I'm not just saying words. I'm saying is that if my wife can find out the information, then how is it safe? You know, it really. You know, it would be a really good way for her not to find the information. <laughs> You're not answering the question. <laughs> You're yeah. returning to the past that we cannot change. You sound like a woman. Well, all Jesus right, let's Christ. not let's what not talk like women. About? <laughs> let's my talk about, God, we in the right now. <laughs> we in the present. So all right, so it's already happened. How can we cover? it up all right it's <laughs> oh my god <laughs> my god jesus i'm sorry you're like hey you should have thought about that three days ago motherfucker it's thursday if i could have fixed it on monday i would have we're in thursday now all right so telling you that it was shitty to do it in the first place does not help anything yeah. Okay, so yeah, good. I've made a lot of shitty decisions in life. Okay, thank you for bringing those up, Captain Hindsight. How do we <laughs> fix it now so I can get my marriage on track, all right? 
You so, fucked so it up. And, so he's going to become a millionaire from Sue and Apple, and then she's going to stay. I mean, look, I don't know if he's going to win the lawsuit. Okay, look, I'm just saying is that I think he has a case. Oh, like, all oh I'm it's saying. enough to bring towards the court. Yeah, 100%. Because it, it doesn't necessarily, it's not about, you see, you're making it about him and the infidelity. I'm making it more about the security of my information. It's, it's like the hot coffee condition at McDonald's. Like, the lady knew even, the coffee was hot, and she spilled it on herself and sued. I don't even think that's like a... Uh, because the cup didn't say it was hot, so when it spilled, she got money for that. So it uh, didn't tell him that it is, wasn't deleting it everywhere, so even though he cloud synced, I don't, no. it needs the warning. Idiot no. proof. I No, I don't even think that's so much the thing. I think it's that when we deal with certain applications, we have a certain degree of trust that we put into those when we enter our name or any other... But he per- has to enable sync. He did it. Yeah, but fix your shit. Apple. What? <laughs> what? what? I, that doesn't even make sense. He enabled sync, but I didn't know my so wife you was going to get on the light switch and then get pissed that the light stayed on when you went to bed and it didn't turn off. So, wait, hold on. So the wife got to his information through the sync. Yeah, his accounts were all synced. That he so like, and then when he deleted the message, it didn't delete it from all devices. It only deletes it from the iPhone. I I want to approach the bench and have a deliberation with my uh with my client. Okay. All right. So look, it's not looking good for you. <laughs> <laughs> all right. You're like, wait a second. My whole my whole argument. I didn't, I didn't realize that the chickens weren't playing. Either. It's fucked, man. God <laughs> damn, the whole fucking way. <laughs> the whole way. Choose forces, bro. That's your pop. The whole week is freaking screwed. That's five videos I got to. Anyway, it's not looking good for you, man. All right. Um, it, it turns out that you enabled the sync onto the video <laughs> or into the uh, the chat that allowed your wife to look at it. Did you know that? He's like, oh, I thought was I thought it would all delete at once. Like, you know, I'd be safe. OK. Um. Yeah, it don't really work like that. Oh, but Apple's fault. They didn't tell me. That's, you know, honestly, you got a case. <laughs> Jesus Christ. They didn't tell them. Why is that not so that you need you? That should be something that you should know. If I were to initiate sync with anybody else, with like a, a an employee or a child, one of my family members, and then that information would become compromised, Apple, what are you doing with your business model? Huh? But it's not compromised. It's on a device you gave permission for. It ain't like it showed up on my phone. But obviously it's compromised because look at my marriage now. <laughs> you compromised it, Apple. Yeah, Apple. Tim Apple, you compromised it. Look, man. I'm not saying that he's going to win. <laughs> I'm saying is that he got it. He's going to take up a, lo- a bunch of government money and taxpayer dollars to yeah, fight yeah. a lawsuit where you going to try to get government rich? and taxpayer i'm pretty sure is that he's got a private consult that he's paying for himself to think that but I'm somebody's pay- paying for the goddamn judge us do we pay for judges who the fuck's paying for the judge bro i don't know i figured that he has a government salary i figured that a government salary or a state salary you know i figured that uh, the th- state government you're not wrong. Federal I figured that. <laughs> I figured that uh, that the the money that like those officials made came from like the fines that they collected, because they're collecting money like all day, right? I think that builds the roads, puts food so in our kids' mouths. All the fines that they get from DUIs and traffic Feeds stops, our children, parking tickets, and that just goes to the roads, is what you think? Is that what you really just think? Your other. No, answer, answer the question. No, doesn't hit me. What do you think? That's what happens. <laughs> uh, all that money pays all of the federal wages and stuff. Okay, fair enough. So, yeah. but also us taxpayer dollars. You and me pay for that judge to give that guy a million dollars because he's an a hole. Okay, fair enough. I'll keep that in mind. Why don't you? <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. I mean, is, is, is it something I should keep in mind, or is it bullshit? You tell me. It's bullshit. Okay. Fair it's enough. all bullshit. Thank Just you like for his- feeding us bullshit, Jonas. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> Next episode. <laughs> That's all the time we have today. So go to uh, crazytown.com for Jonas. This whole week is fucked. <laughs> <laughs> See, here's two. We out. <laughs>